Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to yet another video. I hope you all are doing fine. And finally, I am up with my top picks when it comes to everyday nude lipsticks. And I have seven of my favorite nude lipsticks. So all these lipsticks are very, very affordable and easily available. Almost all the lipsticks are bullet lipsticks except for one. Because I believe when it comes to everyday wear, uh, bullet lipsticks are much more comfortable and easy to carry rather than liquid lipsticks because they tend to get a little bit drier. And also for touch up, bullet lipsticks are really easy. Uh, and when it comes to liquid lipstick, I believe you have to remove the lipstick first and then do the touch up because else it tends to crumble a lot. So I believe uh, for an everyday purpose, bullet lipsticks are the way to go. So I will also be sharing the swatches of all the seven lipsticks on my wrist as well as my lips, both bare skin and with makeup so that you are able to see what the lipsticks looks like on bare skin. Now disclaimer, I have a few acne marks on my cheek area and I am not very much comfortable sharing it on camera but yeah for today's video I have shared it so that it is easier for you guys to make out what the lipsticks looks like on bare skin for a medium skin tone so please ignore those marks and I'll be sharing the formula the pigmentation pricing everything in today's video so that it is easier for you to pick out a lipstick according to your budget and the formulation that you prefer. So yeah, if you want to know what my top 7 picks are when it comes to everyday nude lipsticks, then keep on watching this video till the very end. And if you are new to this channel, hi, my name is Sona Mishra. I post beauty and lifestyle content here on my channel. So please take out a moment and subscribe to the channel down below and don't forget to hit the notification bell right next to it so that you get notified every time I upload a video which is on Tuesdays and Saturdays and also you can check out my Instagram. I post beauty content there as well. So now without any further blabbering, let's just dive right into this video. So all these lipsticks are very very affordable. And I'm going to share it with you in the order of increasing pricing, although most of these lipsticks are for $2.99 each. So the first lipstick I have here are the Nykaa So Creme Creamy Matte Lipstick. Now you must have seen me using these lipsticks in a lot of my videos. Now that's because I absolutely love these lipsticks and these are the two nude shades that I prefer using. These lipsticks retail for $2.99 each. These lipsticks are very very creamy and pigmented, glide on smoothly and they give a really really good pigmentation in just a swipe or two. Now they are very very light lightweight and being creamy lipsticks they are very very hydrating on my lips they are very very comfortable they have a satiny demi matte finish they seem almost matte if you are indoors but outside in the sun they have a little bit of sheen to it so that's why i said satiny demi matte finish but they are very very comfortable to wear and they last you up to five six hours if you are not eating and if you are eating they tend to fade away from the center so the first shade is Daydreaming. It is a cool toned pink with mauveish undertones. If you like your nude lipstick slightly towards the pinkish side, then this is the perfect lipstick for you. It's and the next shade in the same range is Let It Snows. It is a warm toned caramel brown shade. Now again, if you like your nudes to be more on the brownish side, then this is your pick. It is a very, very, very beautiful shade. Now the second lipsticks I have here are from Maybelline Creamy Matte range. Now you guys know my obsession for these lipsticks. I have been using this, these lipsticks since the time I started my makeup journey and I absolutely love these lipsticks. I have a lot of shades in this range but these are the two shades that I prefer on an everyday basis because these are perfect nudes. One is a pinky nude, one is a brownish nude again. So the first shade here is 657 Nude Nuance. It is a very pretty warm brownish nude with a little bit of pink undertones it looks very very pretty on the lips and it is a perfect everyday nude it is my favorite nude color i wear this lipstick all time every time now talking about the pricing they retail for 2.99 each now again these lipsticks are very very creamy and hydrating they glide on smoothly and one swipe is enough for an opaque finish they are very very lightweight again uh, like the Nykaa so Creme lipstick they are very very comfortable and 
they last up to six to seven hours if you're not eating and if you're eating they tend to transfer a little bit now while they are setting they do transfer a bit more but when it is set it gives a demi matte finish and they are transfer proof and smudge proof up to an extent now the next shade i have here is 660 touch of spice another shade which is very very famous from this range it is a warm mauvish brown lipstick as the name suggests touch of spice it gives that a cinnamon and the masala vibe uh, so the shade is really really pretty i like using these two shades again one is more towards the pinky side one is more towards the brownish side not pinkish but mauvish side okay. Now the next lipstick I have is from Faces Canada. This is the Faces Canada Weightless Matte Lipstick. I love these lipstick. Again, I have a couple of shades in this lipstick and I love the formulation. Firstly, the packaging. It looks like the MAC lipstick packaging and the black matte finish. I absolutely love the packaging. And these lipsticks again retail for $2.99 each. Now the shade that I have is the Subtle Mauve 10. So this is a mauvish nude lipstick again. These lipsticks have amazing pigmentation. They have a super rich formula and the pigmentation is also very ultra lightweight. They feel very, very comfortable on the lips and they are infused with almond oil, jojoba oil and vitamin E oil. So while looking absolutely stunning on your lips, this lipstick also nourishes your lips uh, at the same time and your lips feel uh, very, very hydrated. Now again, it gives a demi matte finish to my lips and this is the lipstick that I am wearing right now on my lips and it looks absolutely stunning. I absolutely love this lipstick. Now again, it is not transfer proof or smudge proof, but yes, it stays on for quite a while. It stays on for five to six hours if you're not eating anything. And if you're eating, it fades away from the center like all the other lipsticks. So you have to carry it for touch up. So yeah. So the next lipstick that I have is on a bit pricier and compared to the others, not very, very pricey yet. It retails for 5.95 rupees. It is the My Glam Lit Creamy Matte Lipstick. Now I love the packaging. It is a white packaging with golden detailing and it looks very, very, very pretty. Now the shade that I have here is the Pink Daiquiri and it is a pretty, pretty pink nude. This is the only pink nude that I have. Others still have a mauvish undertone. This is absolutely pink. Now, I don't tend to use pink lipsticks a lot because I feel on my skin tone, I incline more towards the mauvish and the brownish nudes. But this pink color is absolutely stunning and it will suit almost all skin tones whether you are fairest of fair or the deepest of deep this shade is gonna suit all of you very very beautifully so if you're looking out for a good pink lipstick you can try this out pink daiquiri from my glam now talking about the formulation of this lipstick again it is creamy and very very smooth it is non-drying on your lips it gives a demi matte finish again it is very very comfortable on the lips and it does last you for up to five to six hours if you are not eating anything okay. now coming to the last lipstick is a liquid lipstick and i am sure you all know my obsession with this lipstick again because i use this lipstick over almost every bullet lipstick. The lipstick I'm talking about is none other than the Maybelline Superstay Ink in the shade 65 Seductress. This is amazingly beautiful shade. Now you can see on bare skin, it does wash me out a bit. So if you are lighter than my skin tone, it will be the perfect nude shade for all of you. So if you are my skin tone or deeper, then you'll have to pair it up with another bullet lipstick or a dark lip liner. Otherwise, it will wash you out. But as a topper, this lipstick works amazing. If you have any shade that you really, really like, but you want to tone it down or increase the longevity, then you can can definitely top it up with this shade this shade looks amazing over every lipstick i'll just quickly show you how it looks on the lipstick that i am wearing right now and you can see it looks absolutely stunning i am in love with this shade but on bare skin i cannot wear it without a lip liner or any other lipstick underneath but this nude lipstick is very very pretty so talking about the formulation you just saw how rich the pigment is 
This lipstick is amazingly pigmented. One swipe application. This lipstick lasts you forever. Trust me when I say that it lasts you forever. I have worn it for dinner and my li lipstick was still intact. Yes, if you will eat something oily or greasy, your lipstick will fade away from the center. But this lipstick still stays for an amazingly long time. It dries completely matte. And also, if you have very, very dry lips, it can dry you out a bit. So I would suggest always wear a lip balm beneath it, a properly exfoliate and moisturize your lips before before using any liquid lipstick for that matter. So that is one point to keep in your mind. So yeah, with this, we come to the end of all the seven lipsticks. These were the seven lipsticks that I prefer using on day to day basis. And I'm sure you must have seen me wearing these lipsticks on in a lot of my videos. So yeah, you can definitely check these lipsticks out. I have mentioned the links of all the lipsticks in the description box below. So if you want to check out any of these lipsticks, you can uh, head towards the description box. And if you want me to share my favorite pinks, reds, browns, bold colors, liquid lipsticks or any other for that matter, drop them in the comment box below. I'll be happy to make another part of this video. So yeah, with this, I'll wrap up today's video. I hope you liked today's video. And if you did, please consider hitting the like button. Drop your views in the comment box below. And if you have not subscribed to my channel yet, please do it now. Go and hit that red subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the notification bell right next to it so that you get notified every time I upload a new video. Now I will see you super super soon in my next video. Till then stay safe, stay healthy. Bye bye.